sure that we are we are recording it's larry from big valley that's my hawk spotting scope that's an item that i now now sell we'll talk about that some other time though i came out to show you a little something about uh the other side of big valley kind of the more personal side here always been a plant nut always a bug nut always liked the interesting things and what i wanted to show people this morning is a a butterfly that up until maybe five to six years ago never occurred in the Sacramento region. I think the first one collected was about eight to nine years ago, actually by my son. And uh, it's called the long wing. And it was normally found in uh, Mexico, New Mexico, Arizona. It's a semi-tropical type thing. Likes warm, warm weather. Doesn't do well with the cold. Here's another one. Just talking about my fetish for plants you can see here this lantana which is really the size of a large hedge only supposed to be three to four feet tall this is over seven feet everything i plant everything i grow gets bigger than it's supposed to and, and that includes my wife by the way there's a long wing here this is the host plant for them the reason they're here now is we all plant these non-native species which allows them places to lay eggs to have their young we got, oh, they're all over the place here. There's a couple, three or four up here in this garden. Swimming around right now. Hope I'm not jerking this around too fast. I shot some stuff earlier and I actually got pictures of one. There's one right there, he's, he's laying an egg here. Let's see if we can get that over there. Right there, boom, he just put an egg in. Let's see if we can see it. Now he laid it on that old bloom. They're kind of a yellowish color. So I thought, you know, a little something about me besides the mental detecting and the, the other part of me that people know about. When I, when I bought this piece of property 22 years ago, there was nothing planted on it. And that includes those guys there. I plant the black forest, I'm afraid. Here's some of the other stuff here. Actually, this is the wife's collection. When I met my wife, she had a black thumb. I said, that's impossible. So I bought her a fuchsia. That's what these are. Fuchsias are very difficult to grow in the Sacramento region. They're a Bay Area plant. They like lots of moisture and cool or hot and dry. Everybody says, why did you buy her one of those? And I said, because if she can keep this alive, that's one of my favorites, she can keep anything alive. And as you can see, she's got quite a successful collection here of fuchsias. So that's just a little, there's another one of my favorites. That's beautiful, isn't it? Little, diff little different part of Big Valley, but be kind of fun to show something else besides detectors and stuff like that. There's another one of those long wings. Really a spectacular, spectacular butterfly. And they're not very shy either, which makes it kind of fun. Well, that's it. I don't want to bore you too much. Thanks for looking. It's Larry from Big Valley Mineral Detectors.